right here. Carly, I'm here, I promise. Jack? No. This is your host, Carly. Dr. Veston, the spa's founder and director. How are you, Carly? Mm. Oh, yes. You're right, Hilda. The process is coming along quite nicely. Mm. We move on to phase two. So come on, lady, you work here. What's the deal? Everybody being held for ransom or what? How can that be? The spa spends money on you. Mm. Oh, I don't know. Maybe... Like yes. Our work together is proceeding very nicely. Uh, you don't look convinced. Well, Dr. Mike, my skin is, feels really dry. Oh. Is it going to stay like that? I assure you, everything is going exactly as it should. And I must tell you how much I appreciate your, your patience. Mm. I want to assure you that you're going to be very comfortable as we continue to work together. What if I don't want to continue this process? Huh? Oh, no problem. No problem at all. Mm. Here, drink this. Fruit tea? No. No, this is a... Uh, this is a special tonic. It's going to make you feel healthy and strong. Thank you. Bottoms up. Katie, will you please go? Oh, now we're cooking with gas. How's it feel to be back in reality, Emily? Rose! Wow, you look so much brighter. I guess. I feel really good. Good! Yes! Yeah. That's what we need to do. No, no more hits from the bed. Okay? Okay, cross my heart. Good. Now we gotta get to Carly, get her head back on track, and get out of the spa from hell. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. what about the town lady? You think she, think she, think she turned us in? No, she'd be back by now already. You know, she may be friend, not foe. Friend, not foe. Oh, don't worry about it, okay? Just look, very soon you're gonna be home. With your arms around Hal and your little boy, Daniel. It's been a very long time, hasn't it? Yeah. We're gonna make up for lost time. My poorly I'm gonna put my arms around him, I'm gonna hug him, and Carla's gonna do the same with her little boy, and, and that Jack's knife, too. And who knows, maybe the Lulu Jews got there so much, forget about Fred Montgomery. Here is talking about making some changes too. We're yes, gross. yes, yes. Flo, that's uh, right. Yes, we're gonna fly home together, all three of us. Yes. Oh, in a couple hours, you'll be holding Jack's face in her freshly manicured hands. Jack. Jack. I really feel my body. Ah, oh, excellent. When I do, it's like it belongs to somebody else. <laughs> Your progress has been quite remarkable. Exactly what we were looking for. I know who you are. Oh, you do? Mm -hmm. Oh, good. Who? Who? Mm. Who? You are Dr. Doolittle. Uh, no. Mm -hmm. mm. Uh, Dr. Seuss? No. Dr. Spock? No. <laughs> Dr. Scholl, Dr. Shivago. No. Oh, I know, Dr. Richard Kimball. You know the guy from The Fugitive? No, <laughs> no I am Dr. Weston. Uh. But I know who you are. You are Emily Stewart, correct? Uh, how do you know that? Yay! A guessing game! A guessing game! Can I play? Yeah, can no. she play? No, it's not a game, Rose. I was just reassuring Emily that I knew who she was. I know who you are, too. Mm, you must be smart. As a matter of fact, I'm brilliant. <laughs> But, ladies, since you're all here, perhaps you'd like to say goodbye to Carly. Oh, where's she going, Carly? 
she's going to an even nicer spot than this. Oh, <laughs> can we come? Can we come too, please? Oh, please? All, all in good time, not just yet. But don't worry, you'll all be together again soon. No, I want to go now! Now! I want to go now! Please? No, no, that would be ahead of schedule. <sighs> and we don't do things ahead of schedule. But don't worry. We'll see you again soon. Hi. Now, while you, uh, would you care to say something goodbye to your friends? Hmm? Bye. There you are. Uh, Ladies? Yeah. All right, Adam and Abigail here. No, not yet. We were expecting you. Well, Life and death. Yours. Girlfriend Hilda's given Weston an earful? Definitely a possibility. Uh, what's gonna happen next? Oh, I don't know. They could come out and scoop out half our brains like they did with Carly. No, don't say that. That's not gonna happen, right? I mean, Hilda, she inhaled a lot of that woo-woo gas, so, I mean, she's not gonna remember the phone. I mean, stuff's like instant amnesia, right? That's absolutely right. So we're gonna sit back and act like zombies, and it's gonna be fine. Oh, so. everything's gonna be fine. You're so sure about that, huh? Why? Yeah. around the aromatherapy. Of course, Dr. Vestin. I still don't know how it happened. Just see so it doesn't happen again. Now, our next two guests will be ready for the next procedure fairly soon. Make sure that you stay on your toes. Yes, sir. See him, honey. You're gonna be back with him. Cause it's how he's gonna tell the FBI, the CIA, Interpol, whoever he has to tell. He's gonna find us. He's gonna take us home. I'm going home. Home. <laughs> 